Okay, what's up? Uh, I'm going to show you how I send my uh, uh, tracks from my DAW to my Model 12 on uh, separate tracks, okay? So, for example, the bass is going on 6, the piano and uh, on 7 and 8, and the drums on uh, 9 and 10. This is what I recorded. Now everything is coming out of uh, track one and two on my dog. And uh, to do that, I want I will send the bass to um, track six on the model 12. So you have first of all, this is in uh, Cubase, I don't know how to do it in other DOS. You have to make outputs. So I want one mono output. For the bass, I will name it bass, and I want, because the piano is stereo, I want stereo output for the piano and for the drum, so I make two. So this is the piano, and this is the drums. Okay, so the piano, I want to come out on track six on the, on the mixer. So you have to put in six here. No, sorry, the piano, not the bass, sorry, the bass on six. The piano is coming out, I want it on seven and eight. So I put seven and eight. And the drums, is 9 and 10, 9 and 10, and now I have my outputs. Okay, then in Cubase, then you have to go to your mixer. Wait, and I will send them not on stereo out, but the bass is going to the bass. The piano is going to the piano and the drums to the drum. So now if I play it, everything is down. So there will be no sound. But And now they're coming out of 6, uh, 7, and 9 and 10. That's it. Really simple. The cool thing is now you can, for example, if you want to do, uh, if, like the snare is too low in your drums, you can open your drum VST and you can change the snare. You want that or more reverb? You can do whatever you want. The piano also, you can uh, change uh, settings and so. So you can do what you want, and then you can record it from your DAW to your mixer. So the tracks will be on your mix. Okay. I hope you understand. Good luck. Bye bye.